everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm Paul from Gaming Hero. And today we're playing some more Cookie Run Kingdom, so I'm in a really bad mood. To tell you the truth, I'm in a very, very bad mood. Because if you look here, we've made some progress because I feel really dumb. You know what? Here's the thing. I have to say this because if I don't say this, then it's gonna be dumb. I already recorded a video for this, and you know what happened? I was done editing, everything went well, uploading the thing, and you know what happened then? I deleted it. I deleted the whole thing by accident, because I was out of storage. So, yeah. Hopefully this is going to help. I'm really sorry if you guys are disappointed and missing out on some content. Basically, we built, we did a bunch of the basic quests. We expanded our land a bit, we removed some of the obstacles. We built the Lumblejack place where you can make wood for coins. And this place where you make like axes which are used to remove the bigger trees, which as you can see are gone. There were some expansions you could also do by using like three axes. Then we built some houses. Yeah, we also played the first um, level two, three, four, and five. A decent amount happened. Upgraded all most of my cookies to level four. So a couple things did happen after I left, actually, so at least that stuff we have. Open some daily rewards, few things happen. First things first. World Adventure, we have 300 gems from that. You may notice I had a lot of gems. This is actually something that didn't happen in the video, so at least this is new. Um, I pre-ordered this game, actually, and I just checked the mail thing and collected a lot of gifts, as you can see, all of this stuff, so... We have a lot of stuff to do. We have three of these draws, which I'm quickly going to do here. Pancake cookie. Man, we have so many cookies now. So, uh, I'm just going to open these quickly before I continue to catch you guys up. I'm really sorry about all that happened. Obviously, I'm really disappointed about it. It really stinks, but what are you going to do? If we look at our cookies here, a few things happen. So, on the first couple stages... We got Custer Cookie the Third. He's pretty cool. I think he's gonna end up being our king, but it's a little bit confusing. Later at the end, we opened some cookies and got Cherry Cookie. Um, then after that, from pre-ordering, I got Clover Cookie, and then of course we just got Pancake Cookie here. So we're gonna upgrade them both to level four. If you didn't know, you use these like star jellies as XP for your cookies to upgrade them. And I s basically said in the last well. In the deleted footage, that I was going to make sure that I want to keep all my cookies at a fairly even level. No idea what my team's going to be right now, but that's very interesting. I switched to a wizard background because I think wizard's going to be my favorite character. So I'm really disappointed. If you guys missed out on some story, it sucks. Maybe try out the game for yourself. Nothing too, too interesting happened. Um, this person, I forget her name. What? Don't know how I did that. Um, really hates Custard cook King Cookie or whatever. And I think that's pretty much it. So I am... Yeah, I'm. It really sucks. But you know what? We didn't miss out on too, too much. So let's just keep on going with this. More rewards. Man, we have so many cookies. Or so many gems. 1-6. Power tip, 60%. Okay. We are going to edit my team. Because some things need to be changed. Um... Clover Cookie seems good. You seem really useful. I'm gonna put you instead of Ginger Brave. And then I think I'm gonna do this person. What is she? Oh, she's a bard. She boosts. I don't think that's that important. Originally, I said I really didn't want to, but I feel like I kinda need some healing. So I think I'm unfortunately gonna take off that because healing. You, If you didn't know, I actually. Well, you wouldn't know. Um. On the last level, we were doing really well. We still didn't lose a cookie, but we came very close on the last stage. So that kind of sucks. So we're going to test them with a the healer. So in case you didn't know, this guy, Cherry Bomb, she throws a bomb. That's her ability. Pretty useful. He heals and gives everyone a shield. Quite useful indeed. I don't know what this new, like, pancake cookie is going to be. Let's see his ability. Flies down, drops, like, they look almost like acorns on everyone. And it kind of looks like you gave him some sort of buff or something as well, so that's cool. In case you're wondering, by the way, five cookies is the maximum on a team. 
or at least it seems to be the maximum. Ooh, this was something else that was pretty cool. It only happened in one other section so far. There's just like these mini run sections where there's coins and then you collect like an energy potion, which I think heals your cookies. I have a feeling these are things are going to get much more complicated later on, but it's hard to know. It's still obviously quite early on. But the villains are getting pretty powerful. One more interesting thing. I'm going to mention it because it probably won't be, but it might be important later on, is that the K A, we found a lot more cake hounds, and they were eating these like rotten jelly bears, or like the jelly fruit or whatever they're called. So I feel like that could be important, so I just figured I'd mention it. Um, in case you're wondering what I'm going to do with the 9,000 gems, I have no idea. I guess I should open cookies. Should we do that? Was not my intention, but you know what? Sure. Let's start this off. We did one stage just out. Fortunately, we aren't going to be able to do all that much building. Let's build some wood, though, because you can never have too much wood. I guess let's build some axes, too. It's... And we have so many of these, but it's always a good idea. It seems like it's a good idea to stockpile this stuff, but I have no idea. So let's do this. Gotcha. Please tell me I can just skip this. Carrot cookie. That's awesome. Coffee is a magical substance. Did we get her? We totally got her. We got- Okay, you guys told me that she's super good, espresso cookie. Yes, I'm here. What now? Oh, you guys told me that was so incredible. See, already, opening, spending 9,000 gems that I got for free on a bunch of cookies. Beet cookie, common, still cool to add to my collection. Blackberry cookie, she looks so cool. Man, this is like, this is kind of crazy. Obviously, I wasn't expecting this, but this is pretty serious progress. Ninja cookie, swift as the wind. I'm excited, because you know what? Here's the thing. We missed out on some stuff. At least we didn't miss out on this. At least I was here to record this stuff. But I now have to do a lot with all my... Ooh, and we can even rank some of them up. So promote, by the way, if you have enough of the cookies and coins, you can promote them. It did mention something, but it didn't really say exactly what it did. But I haven't gotten the chance to do one yet, but it seems like we can do quite a few now. What's happening? This is a good thing, right? Custard cookie three, the third. So that's cool. Um... You know what, let's just do it to all of them. Promote. If I can promote them to one star, then sure, let's do it. See, this is, still, you know, it's still pretty exciting. All the game is a little boring anyways. This is tons of new stuff to do, I suppose. Obviously, I'm still really sad, but I'm going to try to make the most of it. I hope, I know I've said this a lot, but I hope you guys understand. Understand that there's nothing I can do. I'm honestly really disappointed about it, but what are you going to do? Okay, this is interesting. We have strawberry cookie again. Upgrading her as well. Being alone isn't that bad. That's cool. Okay, and then we have all these new cookies to level up as well. I'm going to level them up to all, all of them to level 4. Is it dumb? Almost certainly, but I'm going to do it anyways. Until this video comes out and all of you yell at me for doing it, I'm going to keep on doing it. Because why not? I don't even know what cookies to use yet, so if... I'm going to be using them. I might as well upgrade them. Um, only thing I can really say is that obviously I'm going to be using the epic espresso cookie. Or espresso cookie. You guys told me she was insanely powerful. A couple of you guys actually got her, which is super lucky. Um, collect all of that. I think we're probably good then. Let's get into this. Let's do some more battles. Because I have a feeling these are going to be very, very fast now. Bear Jelly Village. A village of cute, chewy bear jellies. It's full of cute and chewy things. This was one of our quests, I think, to get here. The Bear Jelly Village, yes. Okay. Wow, cookies! It's so nice to meet you, Bear Jelly Prince. And who might you be? Oh. We are the cute and happy Bear Jellies. We make bear jellies in our village. Wait, why are you so flat and thin? Are you hungry? Oh, this... Am I the only one that's getting a feeling, apart from that face, that this is not going to end well? That's what cookies look like. This won't do. Come and have some bear jellies with us. It's so annoying. I can hardly tell. Um, these are the best. Oh, wait, that's pretty cool looking. I've never tasted bear jellies like that. Amazing craftsmanship. Okay, once again. Eating the bear jellies in Bear Jelly Village 
Something is wrong here. Am I the only one noticing this? This is... This is wrong. That's Wizard Cookie's way of saying give more. Meh. <laughs> uh, I'd have some more too. And me too, but I'm stuffed. Oh, then why don't we take a tour of around the village? Yes, I'm gonna do that every time. It'll aid your digestion. Ooh, where did the red cookie friend go? Okay, no, I'm done. Go. Me? Oh, I couldn't help but visit your storage and snatch some more bear jellies. I see. But the storage was empty. Oh no, that's because the royal jelly carriage didn't arrive. That's ill news. Without royal jellies, we can't make our bear jellies. Maybe we can help. Yeah, leave it to us. We'll help you for treating us. Oh, this is cool. Is this going to be like an XP factory or something? Please, if you meet our bear jelly workers, rescue them. This is cool. Can we do anything else here? Nope, okay. Well, then let's keep going. Let's keep doing some more battles. Um. Treasure chest. Looky, looky. A treasure chest. Completely unattended. This must be the spirit of adventure my dad told me about. Such a pleasant find. <laughs> Finders keepers. Ugh, so heavy. <laughs> Such a pleasant view. What's in the chest or chest? This looks pretty cool. Nothing very great, but still, I'll accept everything I can get. Let's keep on battling because... Wait, no! Okay, I forgot to change my party. I'll change it for next time. I promise. If I remember. I'll probably remember, so I'll change it for next time. Disappointed the wizard's only a common, because I really like wizard, and I want to keep wizard, but I know it just really doesn't make sense looking at this right now. It's pretty obvious that that's the case. But what are we going to do? By the way, can I just tell you something? I'm going to be extra careful not to delete this video, but just in general, can you tell me a ways to help fix storage? If you have any suggestions, because I find I run out of storage very quickly with videos and stuff. They take up a lot of space. So if you guys have any tips on how to, well, not run out of storage, please tell me, because I'd be really interested in knowing just anything to do that can help save storage, if there are any tips. I doubt you know anything too crazy, but anything will help. Suggestions, or I don't know, if you happen to some... I did do a bit of research before basically giving up on how to recover permanently deleted videos. It seems sort of doable through a computer, but really hard, and I didn't. I think it might have been too late. Anyways, Master Sugar Gnome. Ooh, are we gonna save him? I will never eat these foul bear jellies. No, sir. What a picky eater we have here. Then how will you like it if we soak you in water, huh? The suspicious cookie. Rest assured, I can enjoy that much. Is that so? Then how about milk? Milk of pure white that will melt your delicious sugars away. Huh? M Milk? You wouldn't! I beg you! So I guess maybe the same thing with cookies? What's happening here? Leave the sugar gnome alone! Rah! Intruders! Hold on! Help is on the way! Okay, I love this. Also, this music, I must admit, I started this off really, really upset. This music is very relaxing. Just like. Bum, 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 bum. It's really awesome. Do we lose Wizard Cookie? We lost Wizard Cookie! Oh, that's sad. He leveled up at least. That's cool. Unfortunately, we're probably gonna replace him anyway, so I guess he's getting weak. That's not the end of the world. We're about to replace him, basically. Um, I will happily take my rewards. Ah, I can't thank you enough, young ones. My oh my, I didn't introduce myself. My name is my Estro Sugar Gnome. What happened to you? I was in the middle of enjoying my retirement trip. But then, the cake monsters appeared and kidnapped me. They even made me eat those noxious bear jellies, doopity poo. <laughs> Despicable. The monster said it would make me join their nasty lot. We've definitely seen those before. Does this mean eating one will transform you into one of the cake monsters? That's cool. Maybe that's what happened to the poor bear jelly workers. Yeah. Indeed, something terrible must have happened to them. Doopa doopy. Oh, maybe we'll be able to save people then. That'll be cool. Nice to add some more brightness. That won't do. We must save them. Royal Jelly Field. Okay. 
Jelly Worm, what do you do? These are the sacred grounds of the great dragon. You cookies don't belong here. Leave. What? I can't hear you because you're too tiny. I, I shall become the next dragon. Even the greatest of them were as small as me once. I pray daily to become a legendary dragon. This is totally going to be cool. That's the spirit. I understand you with all my heart. Come on, everyone knows that the jelly worms are with the cake monsters. You, do you know where they took the bear jellies? Answer quickly, or else. You're mean. Gone. <laughs> what kind of dragon is that? Let's hit the road. Okay, well, I mean, if you say so. We are changing this, though. Wizard Cookie, unfortunately, you need to be removed for Espresso Cookie. And also, you seem pretty cool, so I think I'm going to replace Cherry Bomb, because I don't really love Cherry Bomb. Let's get into this. Let's battle, once again, Poison Mushroom Cookie. Nidashumi? That looks very terrifying. Okay, let's test our new abilities. First things first. I think it was blueberry cupcake or whatever. Seems to have like a poison effect. What do you do, espresso cookie? That's a black hole! She just summoned a black hole. Did you see that? Oh, wait, that's crazy. I must. Oh, look at me. I'm espresso cookie. You know what I'm gonna do? Summon a black hole. That better work, shouldn't it? Very, very, um, interesting, to say the very least. So it looks like today we're probably going to be doing lots more battles, unless, unfortunately, most of the base building stuff seems like we got to leave in the lost footage, but at least we have some cool battles here to do. I still don't, I think I should save the shield for when they're actually fighting whatever. At least we still have some pretty cool battles, though, when we have that awesome cookie opening, which worked pretty well. That gives me my title, too. Pre-ordering is OP. That's going to be the title, by the way, in case you're curious. Unless I decide not to be, but I'm pretty sure that's when I'm going to make it. Okay, let's use our shield. Keep us all safe. Use some abilities. I think this is the last wave, if you look at the bar. Black hole to finish it off, because why not? Yes, yeah, Espresso Cookie is seriously OP. Um, good thing I got her before her event ended. What are we going to do? So I guess technically this is technically... Keep this in mind, guys. This is technically a double upload. I just did part of it off camera by accident. Yeah, It's annoying, but what are you going to do? Expand and decorate your kingdom to upgrade the castle. I want to do that because it seems like there's some cool things you can do once you get that. Like tons of new buildings and expansion. The kingdom pass is open. You can now engage in daily and seasonal missions for rewards. Okay. I'm not buying the special kingdom pass, but I'll claim these. Lots of XP and stuff. Uh, that's the premium stuff, but we do have this. 500 coins, 20 stamina, making sure we never run out of stuff, and some XP. Okay, well that sounds cool. Um, what's that? Oh, that's the Royal Jelly Field. What does this do? Remove. Okay, zero seconds, just take snacks. We're good. Royal Jelly Field. Wait, first, events. I have things to collect, obviously. 300 gems for completing some stages, and for using some stamina. Even more gems, man. Gems are not a hard thing to come by in this game, that is for sure. I don't really mind that I spent 9,000 now. Though I do think the rest, I have no idea if it's worth it. I think I'm going to save the rest from uh, sugar gnome things. I have no idea if it's worth it, but I want to do it. Because I feel like I feel like that's worthwhile. I don't know, maybe it's better to just save the cookies. But since we already spent 9,000 on that, I feel like the rest I'm going to invest in, I guess, buildings. Buildings? Yeah, I guess it's buildings. Crit up, so she's like a- she boosts people too. Though it did look like she had some sort of poison ability before, though. I could be wrong. Okay, black hole time. This is the time. Oh, it canceled her ability! So those, like, dragon things can, um, what's it called? It seems they can, like, stun your cookies or something like that. That's cool. Not good cool, but still cool regardless. Black hole again. This time it should work. Yep, we are good. More abilities, because why not? That's mostly what we're doing here. We're just spamming abilities, after all. What else would we do, I mean? Anything else would just be boring. Seems we might be moving on to the second last fight? Second last fight. Black hole again. We actually got this one off. Still didn't go perfectly, but worked pretty well there. Shield and all of the abilities just to end it off. No idea if that worked. We killed them? Yeah, we killed them. Okay. 
Stage nine, Royal Jelly Field seems to be completed. Okay. Um. Everyone looks happy, but Espresso Cookie looks like she's crying, and I don't like it. I'm sure it's still laughing or something, but it seriously looks like she's crying. Every landmark provides a special effect for your king. That was another thing. We got access to, like, decorations or whatever, which I'm not a big fan of. But they had these, like, special collection things. I'll show them to you in a second. First, gonna collect this. Look, the bear jellies. Aw. Wow. Bad cake monsters attacked us. They took all our royal jelly. How unjust. We'll punish them for that. Okay, that's cool. First, back to the kingdom, because I want to show you guys this. A, get to collect my XP. What is this? Smithy production. Complete a crafting of robust axe three times. Okay. Uh, there's no real reason to, but I'll do it anyways. Um, I'd like to turn this moment into a song. Yeah, I think they give you different quests or something. It's weird. But I do like that you can just see the cookies running around your village. Anyways, I was looking at shop A. I'm going to build a sugar gnome's hut. It says I can have up to three, so I guess this is the only... Yeah, I don't know. Maybe this is a waste, but I'm doing it anyways, so done. Yeah, I can't build anymore. Decor, though. We can go here if you see there's this. It says reduces production time minus 1%, but it requires some pretty crazy stuff. And 50,000 coins, which I actually am getting pretty close to. But that's what they mean by the landmarks, in case you're curious. Um, What else? Shop, do you have something? Nope, that was just because I got espresso cookie. Okay, well, let's keep on going, continue on. Treasure chest, what is in the chest? Let's see. Anything good? Pretty decent. It doesn't look like anything too incredible. Pretty decent. I think we're going to make it to the Royal Jelly Apiary since this is going to be mostly battles, and then we'll probably be done after that. But I don't know. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed still, even with a little bit of mishaps that have occurred. I've been really enjoying this, so thank you guys for letting me know, by the way, that you wanted me to continue this series, because if you hadn't told me, I probably would have stopped. I think currently my plan is probably going to be to do, probably alternating, like this, between this game and Bloons Adventure on Tower Defense, probably like alternating, switching between the two, which one I do, is probably my plan currently. Let me know, though, if you guys at any point are interested in more of this game, or you want a bit of a break, just let me know whenever you, whatever you feel like, I'm happy to, obviously I want to know your opinion. So, if you ever have, did that shield not work, or did I not activate the shield? It sort of seemed like we were attacked, and then my shield turned on afterwards. Not the greatest thing. Anyways, I think we're moving on to the final boss, though. Pretty decent damage, completely melted the boss, but these last few enemies are being a bit more annoying, so... What do I say when they're getting annoying? Black hole. Well, now. Now I'll say that, okay? From now on out. I still love this, though. I must admit, I'm still really disappointed that we missed the battle stuff, or the base building. But I have a feeling there's gonna be more to do once we get this cookie crown. I think we unlock, like, a kingdom or whatever, which, or like, a castle. Which is basically, I think, some sort of, like, town hall thing, and it sounds super cool. So I think this is gonna be our second last battle? Milk cookie. Let's join our forces. Snow sugar cookies, something. By the way, out of curiosity, do you guys think that in the end of this, we're going to end up collecting the five, like, champions, and those are going to be the best cookies in the game? Or do you think those are just going to be five cookies you get, but they're not all that good? They're just more so, like, you get them, they'll be strong for a bit, but later on, they get replaced for more, like, premium characters or something like that. I'm curious to know. This game clearly, if you didn't see the levels, it clearly has a lot of stuff, so I doubt we will be finishing this game anytime soon, which is great, because who would want to finish a game when it came out literally three days ago? It's still only been three days, yeah, it might be hard to believe. I'm sure some of you are already finishing it, but... Well, actually, no, hopefully none of you have finished this game. If so, you play a lot. I don't know how you have that much free time, but you know what? Maybe you're just very, very talented. I have no idea. So, regardless, that was a... I mean, not a horrible combo, but a bit of a waste. Seems like he was like a speed buff or whatever whenever we used his ability. Always a little too late with those shields. Every single time. I need to get better with my timing of abilities. Black hole to finish it off. And I think we're good. 
one more stage to do. Okay, one more stage. Because I think we unlock a town or something now. That's what it looked like. Level five for some more of our cookies. Okay, I'm just gonna exit for a second. You ready? You wanna load game? Any second now. Okay, cool. Yeah, because we're on the Royal Jelly Apiary. Okay, this is going to be the final stage. I feel like this is going to be a big deal, so I'm going to do this. It'll be done in a sec. Mandolin cookie. I don't know to feed. Okay, that sounds like a pretty cool cookie. I feel like I want to collect every cookie in the game. That's going to be my goal. It might be impossible. This is obviously, I don't know how many cookies there are. I don't know how many cookies there will be. So that might be an impossible task, but that's going to be my goal. I'm saying it now on episode two. My goal, my goal is to collect every single cookie, and if I fail... Then I fail. I'm not gonna care all that much. Because I have no idea. Maybe there's literally no point. It just sounds like a cool thing to say. That'll be the goal for this series, I guess. Collect every cookie. Become the Cookie King. I mean, I guess that's the whole point. It's called Cookie Kingdom for a reason. Ooh, there's prisoners. We're gonna save some people here, right? That's gonna be the end here. I'm gonna do some epic crazy thing. Save everyone. I have a feeling that's gonna be what, exactly what happens. I use way too many abilities there. Shield in advance. I think it's actually up in time now. Good. I feel like I always use the shield and then I get hit and then the shield activates afterwards. Anyways, are we going to rescue some people? Is there going to be some story? I'm a little disappointed because the first few levels had tons of people talking and now it's just less talking. What happened? How to get coins fast? Fulfill the cookie's wishes at the tree of wishes. Yeah, I think each individual cookie can give you, like, random quests and stuff, which is nice. Potentially after we get some Tree of Wishes, but who knows. Um, claim. Yes, thank you. More bear jellies. Aw. Cuffs, thank you for saving us. The cake monsters are making bad bear jellies with our royal jelly. Make sure to always check your food's origin and expiration tape. Yes, make sure to check that. Don't eat expired food. Unless it looks perfectly fine. It's usually fine. Depending on where you live. If you didn't know, apparently in Canada, it's a fun fact. Um, expiration date isn't actually an expiration date. It's a, like the best before dates. They're when you can ensure the food's at its peak quality. So they're not actually bad after it's gone. I skipped that by accident. Playing around with food, that's beyond my forgiveness. Okay. Royal Bear Aviary? No, just looks pretty cool. Wow, the cookies have come to save me! This is a very big bear jelly. The cake monsters made me eat weird bear jellies. I was so scared. No, please save. I hope we can save him. Hmm, you show no signs of transformation. Bear jellies are good in any shape. I'll be fine. The cake monsters took my friends. Please save them. I hope he didn't- Oh, there's totally a boss. We're saving that for next time. Because I'm mean in that way. <laughs> no. But I'm totally am waiting for next time. Smithy production. Quest complete. XP to collect. What's this? Use XP to upgrade. Oh, we already did that. Okay. Cool. I'll collect my reward. Next. Buy and place one decor. You know what? Sure. We're going to end this off. We're going to build some decorations. Because why not? Um, Taco Gazebo. That looks pretty cool. We're going to build that over there. You happy? Happy quest? Okay. Um, but yeah, please consider giving the video a like if you enjoyed. Subscribing to join the Purple Elephant Squad. It makes my day. It's super nice, and I really do appreciate it. I hope you guys are having an incredible day and are doing something fun with your weekend, since it is Saturday. Until then, I will see you all tomorrow. Have an incredible day. Bye!